What's going on guys? I'm Dan. This is Santa Waters and today I have a review for you from the house of LeBron Parfums. Like to hear my thoughts about it? Stay right there. Not too long ago I did a review on Egyptian Honey from the house of LeBron Parfums. And to me, Egyptian Honey is a great fragrance to layer with other fragrances to give it more of a honey base, a sweeter base in my opinion. So a few weeks back, Deborah from LeBron Parfums reached out to me and asked me if I'd like to smell one of their fragrances or test them out and review it. I said, sure, why not? Because the first fragrance was actually pretty good. So I'd like to see what else she offers. So she sent me Ocean Coast Intense. Before I get into the actual fragrance, the bottle has a nice decant style bottle, but it is a pretty thick glass and the label up front and the sprayers actually pretty damn good. Before we get into the fragrance, how about the notes? For the top notes, you have citrus, mint, cucumber, and sea salt. For the mid, you have dewy rose, green lily blossom, and seaweed accord. And for the base, you have weathered driftwood. At first sniff, I get a herbal minty vibe, very watery with a cucumber background in there. It smells very dewy. And honestly, it has that very ocean coast type vibe. Just like the name says, just because I said it has a wateriness to it, doesn't mean that it's a very thin fragrance. It actually has a pretty thick density to it, in my opinion. But further into the dry down, the rose starts coming in a little bit more. It starts getting a little bit more floral. I, it wouldn't be like a, a feminine floral, but you can tell that there's some type of floral aspect to it, which in my opinion is the rose, since the rose is in there. But when that rose pops up, it's a combination with the rose and the cucumber to me. It actually is very, very pleasing in my opinion. It's a great fragrance that I feel works great for the spring, great for the summer, great for the beach vibe. This is the type of fragrance that'll put you in a mental vacation in, in my opinion, but that will put you by the beach. If you're in quarantine still and can't get close to the beach, this fragrance I feel can give you that watery aspect, that beach vibe. It actually has a little saltiness to it in my opinion too. After that five to 10 minutes when you start getting that dewy rose and that cucumber mix, a little bit more further into the dry down, it actually gets a little bit saltier, which is very pleasant. It gives you that ocean mist, like as if you're standing right next to the, at the beach and you're getting that ocean mist hit you in the face, but with a slight rose water and cucumber vibe. So it's like, it's really hard to explain, but it's a very refreshing scent. It's not really hard to explain. I just said what it is. To me, that's what I get. This is a very nice scent, Deborah. In my opinion, you did another great job. Egyptian honey was dope, and so is this ocean mist. Summer, spring, this is a perfect fragrance for you. In my opinion, this is a very non-offensive fragrance. I don't see anybody complaining about this whatsoever. For me, this lasts about six to seven hours. I work outdoors, I sweat a lot. This lasts up to the seven hour mark. And on close, I know it would last a little bit longer. Given this a scale rating one out of 10, I give this a seven and a half to eight mark. This is a very solid fresh fragrance that I think works great for this hot weather coming up. If you're already in that heat, I think this will work perfect for you. Try it out, get a sample if samples are available. She has multiple size bottles. I think these are the only two, but there might be another one. I'm not 100% sure, but these are the two bottles that she sent me of the same fragrance. So with that being said, I'm gonna keep this bottle and this bigger bottle will be a giveaway. So if you wanna be entered in the giveaway, just like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section that you wanna be entered for this bigger bottle of Ocean Coast Intense by LeBron Parfums and boom, you're in. So there you go guys, that's my take on LeBron Parfums Ocean Coast Mist. Let me know if you heard of anything about this company or if you ever heard, tried anything from them. In my opinion, they're pretty dope. So like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think. Ocean Coast Intense by LeBron Parfums. Solid fresh scent in my opinion. But at the end of the day, Still scented water.